What to do when the computer screen appears black and only the mouse cursor is visible. In this video I am going to give you several easy and quick solutions to solve it and make our computer work normally. You will see how easy it is to solve. It's not a common problem, but it does happen sometimes. We have turned on our laptop. In this case I have Windows 10 installed and the typical random image appears. So far everything normal. You see the mouse cursor and obviously the video card works. But it's when we click to start our session that the screen goes black. We can still move the mouse and we see the arrow icon but nothing is seen or Windows 10 loads. No matter how much we move it or click there is no response from the computer. The most common thing in a crash situation is to always resort to the task manager so that's the first thing I've done. The shorthand command is Control plus Alt plus the delete key. In this case I am pressing it several times but there is no response. The screen remains black and after a minute or two it returns to the startup image again. When clicking to start the session again the screen goes black and so on. For those who do work with the delete alt control command, the solution is very simple. If the task manager opens, it is as simple as clicking on file. Then run new task. And here in this create new task menu in open we are going to write explorer.x. We activate the option to create this task with administrative privileges. We give it to open and in a moment the Windows system starts. Very easy. But let's go back to the previous case in which I have a black screen. The cursor appears but it does not respond to instructions or open the task manager. Even in this case it is possible that it allows us to access the projecting modes of the screens. To do this we can press the corresponding key on our keyboard or the command Windows plus P. Sometimes selecting the first option is resolved and the image returns. Otherwise we go with the third solution. We see that the laptop is working and has the keyboard lighting on. The fault is not from the laptop nor is the screen or the graphics card faulty since it shows the cursor and some menus such as projecting. The error is from the system itself. So what we're going to do is hold down the home key for a few seconds. If we press it once quickly it will only suspend the session and we will not solve the problem. So you have to press the button continuously until the computer turns off. You see that right now there is no light. We have turned it off roughly, as if we disconnected the charger from the current without a battery. We are going to leave it like this for about 10 seconds and then we are going to start it again. At the moment it seems to start normally. The random image appears again when turning on. But now when clicking, the option to log in as a user appears. We can type the password if we have it set for this user. And we see that it starts normally. It's that simple. I hope you have found it very useful. If so, you can invite me to a simple coffee by donating a symbolic amount of only $3 through the link in the description. Much cheaper than sending the laptop to be checked by a technician. Of course it is voluntary but I would really appreciate if it was helpful. All the best and enjoy your day.